Hello everyone, Assalamu alaikum. I hope you all are fine by the grace of Almighty and doing good in your life. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Do subscribe my channel and forward in your circle. Today I am here with the new topic related to food irradiation. So let's start the topic. Before moving on, let's start from the basics. Electromagnetic radiations cover a broad spectrum of wavelength. It includes sunlight, which is vital to life on Earth. Radio waves enable us to communicate. Microwave cook our food. Infrared radiation warms us. Visible light illuminates our life and is essential for food production. UV rays radiations give us sun tan and bone strengthening vitamin D. X rays enable us to diagnose and treat illness. Also used to check our luggage on airports. Gamma rays are used to sterilize medical equipments. Irradiation using X-rays and gamma rays can also be used to treat food by choosing the right wavelength and dosage. These rays can prevent sprouting of vegetables like potatoes and maintain their freshness and taste. Food irradiation also destroy harmful bacteria that could be present in spices, meat and seafood. It also enhances shelf creeping freshness of fruits and vegetables to transport to other regions of the world. Food irradiation involves shining electromagnetic rays or beam of electrons onto food. The energy is transferred at an intensity necessary to give the desired effect. Food irradiation is a called process so that food retain their unique flavor and aromas. It also avoids reliances on chemical methods such as fumigation, pesticides to combat bacteria, insects or other spoilage microorganisms. This irradiation beams pass through the packaging so that food remains protected from bacteria or insects and hence remain fresh all day long. Offers a chemical-free and heat-free approach. It maintains fresh food quality and reduces the risk of foodborne diseases. Gamma rays are passed through the food to be irradiated and the food thus is sterilized and preserved. This preservation method is approved by Food and Drug Administration for the use with the specific food items. The whole process is carried out by a machine called E-Beam Machine. This machine is electronically generated. The following food items are eligible for food irradiation process you can see on the table. This symbol is used for the food item which are food irradiated. So that's it from today's video. Thank you for watching my video. Do subscribe my channel for further videos and content. Till then Allah Hafiz and take care of your family.